Ahoy, Meat Popsicles! I'm the Mock Dr. Phil, and this is FTL Advanced Edition. Let's get started. So, the idea behind this series is to beat the game with every ship on normal uh, before graduating onto hard. As you can see, I've done it on easy with every ship. Missing a couple achievements here or there, but for the most part, everything has been done on easy. So, let's hit random and get going. Okay. NGC. Not that bad of a ship. We have a Lanius crew member. Drains oxygen from room. Slow movement, but no damage from lack of oxygen. We have a couple of NG crew members. Uh, repair speed is doubled, but combat speed is... Combat damage is halved. We have dual lasers. One, which we can do one damage to one shield if everything hits. And we have a beam one drone. We also have a clone bay and hacking, as well as a defense scrambler, which will be good once... Uh, we got some missile weapons and also keep our hacks uh, from being shot down. And uh, overall, an okay ship, maybe? Let's get going. Alright, so the uh, point of this is to reach the end of the game, beat the Rebel flagship. So, the data you carry is vital to the remaining Federation fleet. You need supplies for journey, so make sure to explore each sector before moving on to the next. But get to the exit before the pursuing Rebel fleet can catch up. Okay, let's power on everything we want to power on. Clone Bay does not need to be on to get the benefits unless somebody dies. Beam drones cannot be turned on unless there is an enemy vessel. So the strategy here is um, get their shields down as quickly as possible and let the beam drone just wreak havoc because beams cannot get through shields for the most part. On pause, uh, do we like where everybody is? Yeah, I guess. And we have... Okay, so we're gonna bounce around a little bit and check out this distress beacon. Uh, I don't have any of that, so I have to respectfully decline. Great start. Store right off the bat. I can't really do much with that. But uh, if we loop around this way now, we might be able to make enough to maybe buy something. Okay, first combat. The rebel ship has been patrolling this region. As soon as you arrive, it begins its assault. So let's pause, turn on the beam drone. Uh, they have weapons that can really screw with us. They take down our shields with this temporarily, and then the beam drone can slice us apart, the beam weapon can slice us apart. So let's hack their weapons, target shields, and that will allow the beam drone to get going. And what we want to do is we want to try and desync. So we're going to have this thing fire, but then hack, so our shields will come back. Okay, they missed anyways. If they would have hit, uh, we're kind of getting their weapons off sync, so if they're Heavy laser hits, our shields come back before the beam can do anything, and we are going to continue shooting their shields. Good, shields are down. Now our beam drone can wreak havoc, slowly. And we're going to keep shooting shields, get that down, they're trying to escape. They're not going to, because they took their pilot off to repair. And one more. Alright, done. Ship explodes and we get one fuel, one missile, and 17 scrap. Excellent. Moving it right along. Uh, this is a dead end. Yes, we'll go here and loop back around, try to get to that store. Uh, all of our military ships have been destroyed or damaged during the rebellion. However, there have been reported of Mantis War Camp. Only a few jumps from us can you help? Sure. Thank you. Just give a count on their numbers. Perhaps we can get the rebels to help. Add a quest marker and we get 16 scraps. So free stuff is good. So basically what you want to do is you want to get to this exit beacon here. Before you get caught in this uh, red area. These are the rebels. They catch up to you. Uh, they will attack you with more advanced ships than you're capable of dealing with possibly. And they also eat beacons. So you want to try and hit as many beacons as you can before the rebels eat them. So let me go, what can we do once we get to the store? We can go like this. Okay, so let's try it. Uh, 
Explore the asteroid field. Now we can get free stuff from this. We can get into a battle. We can just take hull damage. Let's go. And five damage to our hull. We have a fire. Luckily there's a door right next to it for the oxygen. No more fire. Fix up the drone control. Put everybody back. And continue on. Okay, so there's another store here. But we really don't have that much scrap or things to sell. It's going to be close at hitting all these beacons. Alright, now this one's super dangerous, but we do have a clone bay. So if somebody dies, they will be resurrected. So it's just call small research station, small laboratory fire got out of control. If we dock and try to rescue the survivors, we might get another crew member. If we send the crew to, and a shuttle to build the fire, we might get scrap. Let's uh, let's try and put out the fire. We get 19 scrap. Nice. Okay, let's close the store up, by the way. Can we make the store before it gets eaten? Probably not. One. Two. One, two, it's gonna be really close. We'll know better once we get to that distress beacon, and the distress beacons give us uh, better rewards sometimes. So, even if we do not get to the store before it gets eaten by the rebels, we can at least do the distress beacon. Uh, if we try to dislodge the ship, I shoot into rocks. We might get something. Destroy and loot the ship. They're just pirates. That usually works better. We might get a little bit of combat. Let's try that. Okay, we do. They decide the pirate is not worth saving. Fire a few volleys into their hull before you can scrap the remains. Another pirate ship flashes on your radar. Perhaps they saw your deed, or perhaps they want to claim the spoils for themselves. But for whatever reason, they're charging weapons. Alright, let's pause quickly. Now, this ship has a missile weapon. Will go through shields. They also have an ion weapon, which doesn't really work, doesn't synergize well with missile weapon. The only missile defense we have right now is our 20% chance of evade right there. They also have a Zoltan shield, which has five hits that they can absorb if four we can actually get through and start damaging their systems. But luckily, our beam drone will slowly slice through all of that and we can fire our dual lasers as well. Fortunately, our hack will not get through the super shield. Super shields prevent hacking, so we can't slow them down. We're going to have to eat the first missile, potentially. And it hits our engines, but there's an engine there ready to fix them up. And good. Okay. I'm going to try to go on weapons next. Our shields are down. That is not good. Not that it really matters because they don't have anything that bounces off shields. Get back to base. Pilot got hit. That's not good. Our drone just got ioned. Even better. But our missile is down. They want to surrender. Uh, I will not take it. I have no need for missiles. Let's see who they have in their ship, because they're repairing pretty quickly. They have a mantis and a human. Now there's a fire. Let's see, maybe the fire can kill them. If we can kill the crew, Never mind, they have a... Uh, the fire took them out. Okay. Even if you kill the crew before the ship, you get better rewards. Get a little bit more scrap by... Not taking this turn off. And yes, the store did get eaten. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to jump here, jump into the nebula. That will give us an extra bit of time. Nebula here will make the fleet pursuit slower, but will disrupt your sensors. So that's what we're going to try and go for. Except a bribe. Two fuel, two missiles, eight scrap. Try to be a hero. Let's go have a missile weapon, and that's about it. 
let's attack. They have a combat drone of their own. That's not particularly good. Let us hack shields. That didn't do much. There's a fire. Luckily, it's an easily ventable room. Fire on shields. Good. Miss. Excellent. Let's fire on weapons now. They would like to give us a more generous bribe. Uh, no. I would like to kill you. Close this door. Their weapons are completely down. We can hack their shields again. Hacking shields is not really that great until you upgrade uh, the hacking timer. Ugh. And they're dead. Only got nine scrap, so might have been better to accept their bribes. Yeah, but sometimes that happens. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do Nebula. Exit quest. That quest usually doesn't have much by way of reward at this point. But we will try it anyways. Pirate ship arrives shortly after you, judging from the fact that it's attempting to avoid your ship. You assume that's a smuggler trying to stay away from the beacons. Let's attack. Of course, always attack. And they can't do anything to us. Absolutely not. They have... Well, a laser that fires one shot. We have one shield. We'll block that. They really cannot do anything to us. We can hack them, but I think I'll save the drone part. And we're just going to auto fire on shields. And we missed. Just poke our heads into the sensor room. Oh, we have no sensors. That's silly. I'm in a nebula. What am I thinking? The only way to see uh, the enemy crew in a nebula is if you have a slug crew member, which can telepathically sense the beings on board the other ship. They're trying to escape. Alright. Uh, FDL is delayed. They move their pilot out of the pilot seat to repair. Hey, we got a, we got a human. Feet to faint, life signatures from the impact place of the hole. Piece of the hole, intact piece of the hole. Wow, can't read today. They're transporting prisoners, and a sole survivor offers to join your crew as a first step on his path to get revenge. Okay, Brecken. Let's get you out of the helm where the planning has sucked all the oxygen. And we will put you on shields. And that will slowly give us better regen when our shields go down. Let's save your position and continue jumping. Let's see, how many jumps do we have before? We got one, maybe two, three, one, two. We might be able to squeeze four out. Asteroid field. Okay, another Zoltan shield, another missile. But the asteroids will work with us here. The asteroids will impact their shield, take it down a little bit. They hit our helm again. And our O2 room is now on fire, so let's get the air out of that. Taking a lot of damage from asteroids. Close all doors, open all doors, got the oxygen pumping. Get it repaired. Close all doors again. Mm -hmm. 
All right. Everybody back to stations. I don't think we'll be able to go to that quest, which is fine. It doesn't really offer much reward. Water station, look for survivors. Sure. Suddenly, one of your crew bends over, starts fetching violently some sort of disease. Once the wiped out the station, you pull back. Crew member's not going to make it. Uh, not right. Carmeroy is gone. And for some reason, the virus will continue on into the clone. So we lost Pomeroy. We lost our engineer. So, frickin', we've been promoted. And this sector has gone pretty badly. I'm gonna go Mantis Controlled. And if there's no store readily, there it is. There's a store. Uh, let's try and get a couple of beacons before the store. This will probably kill us. One fuel for four missiles. I don't use missiles, and I'm going down on a fuel pretty soon, so no. For once you see a mantis before to see you, attack the ship. Attempt to remain concealed. Let's attack. Turn on the beam drone. We have a bomb and looks like a dual laser. So they can they can uh, mess us up a little bit here. Let's hack weapons and fire on shields. And the shields are down. Nice. Ooh, ship explosive behind a substantial collection of useful scrap material, reconstructive teleport. So if we do get a teleporter, which right now not really that smart of an idea, every time we teleport our people, they will get healed. So that's very useful. A couple of stores, I think we're gonna try to loop around a little bit, hit both of them. See what's at this store. We have a Pike Peen Burst Laser Mark II, which is actually really okay. Burst Laser 3, not so much. Pike Beam is okay. Backup Battery, Med Bay, Mind Control, a couple of crew. Hmm. We're gonna need another pit of power, plus the 80. We're gonna get this going. We get an extra shot. Equipment uh, upgrades will cost us a hundred and twenty. Hundred and twenty just to get the burst laser up. Uh, we're doing okay for now. I'd much rather have maybe some repairs. Fuel, a uh, little bit of shield upgrade, missile uh, missile defense in the form of evade, and the engine's up. But it is pretty good. An extra shot. Or only... I'm going to say no for now. Going to buy... Fuel. Fix up a bit. Now we can still get it. We lose up all our remaining scrap if we do this. Uh, eh, who dares wins, right? So that off, put that on. I made this gun will have five shots, so it's pretty okay. Only problem is we might need yeah we're gonna need 
No, we're good. Oh, yeah, we're gonna have to take away something from oxygen in order to get the beam drone up, which is okay. 12 seconds versus 10 seconds, so... Might not have been the smartest of ideas, but let's go with it. Okay, they have a missile and a laser. Turn that on. Not enough power. Let's hack weapons. Fire on weapons. Turn off oxygen for now. Turn on the beam drone. Got the wrong weapon offline. Miss, miss, miss. No empty room. Now there's a fire. Right, now they can't heal. Let's turn off our drone. Let's not fire. Let's let the fire damage. Let's see if we can kill their crew. Let's turn on oxygen while we wait. And the fire will either destroy a system and blow them up from the inside, or they will die. They died, yes. Crew dead, you're able to take the fuel out of storage. Also take all the scrap you can manage for fuel, 28 scrap. Beautiful. Let's use that to get the power up so we don't have to take away from oxygen to get the beam drone up. Let's close this door. And continue on. Okay, they're gonna board us. So all we're gonna do is we're gonna hack the teleporter that will force them to teleport back. But they have some scary weaponry. So let's try and burst laser weapons to start. Good. Got the lasers off, so now this beam cannot hurt us. We're on one bubble. There's a fire in weapons. Excellent. Let's get shields next. Shields are completely down. Go go ahead into the sensor room, see what they're working with. Uh, we have enough fuel, and I can probably get more scrap by killing them, so we will kill them. Hacking uh, a system also locks the doors, so that kept people trapped in the top of the ship, keeping uh, repairs from happening efficiently. And yeah, 24 scrap. We definitely got more by doing that. Let's put everybody back. Oops, sorry. You're our engine guy now. Let's save his new position. And... Jump around. They have a teleporter as well. Your ship would make a mighty fine prize. Prepare for battle. Okay. Have a missile and a dual laser. Burst laser. Weapons, turn beam drone on, and we will once again hack the teleport.
We're gonna run low on... Okay, let's get... RNG to repair that. We're gonna run low on drone parts pretty soon. Prepare for a street. They're gonna try and run. Let's fire on their shields, keep those down. Now there's a fire. And they're dead. Three fuel, one missile, 24 scrap. Excellent. We can hit this door before it gets eaten, so we will do that. And we have defense drones, hull repair, anti-drone, cloaking, teleporter, medbay. Defense drone will protect us from missiles. A uh, couple of crew, a couple of weapons. I think uh, we definitely want to get the defense drone protect us from missiles. We will fix up and carry on. Really need to get some ship upgrades in pretty soon. Once you arrive at the location of the distress call, a civilian ship hails you. Thanks for responding to our beacon. Our FDL navigation has gone haywire and we can't plot a course to the nearest depot to get it fixed. Could you lead us there? Of course. Take this bit of scrap as a down payment. We'll use your jump signatures to follow you. You're really helping us out here. Hey, it feels great. Peace Federation, non Federation. We gotta stick together. Quest marker in the next sector, 11 scrap. Let's go. Another trust beacon down here. Looks like there's another beacon hidden behind the sign. Uh, let's see how many jumps do we get? One, two, three, four, five, six, six or seven. So we can maybe jump around like this. So we'll go up and over and down. You spot a small rebel ship nearby. It seems they've been refitted for transport. Does not seem to want to engage your ship. Demand a surrender of their goods. They're going to try and run. Uh, they can get through our shields. No need for defense drone on this. We will hack their piloting to keep them from running. And we will burst laser weapons because it's pretty dangerous. Then we'll see if we'll need to beam drone. I don't know if we'll need to beam drone. Yeah, right. Okay, turn dual lasers on for now. Put the beam drone on. Let's fire on weapons again. Good. Dangerous weapons off. Let's fire on piloting. They're probably gonna get out. They're gonna run. Yeah. It happens. The ship doesn't really have much that can stop that. The one on the right is starting to rot, take him down, take off his fingers, put him out of the airlock. They certainly don't seem to be friendly. Attack! They can fire three shots, we can fire three shots. We will hack weapons. Beam drone on. Wow, we missed everything. Good job. <laughs> they hit our O2. Alright, we can fix it after the battle, probably. 
shoot weapons again. Good. Big lasers down. Bomb is an ion bomb that hits nothing. Yay. Let's go for shields next. Alright. Let's get this oxygen fixed up. Potential collection of scrap. Beautiful. Anything? Can we upgrade anything with this? Just get shields up. But we won't use the beam drone. Now what am I saying? We need 50. We have 30. No. Uh, we can get dodge chance up. We have the defense drone now. Huge amount of misplays on my part. Probably shouldn't have gone for the burst laser. But we'll see. Alright, let's hit the distress beacon up. Send a crew, giant alien spiders are no joke. Usually this kills a crew member and we don't get anything. But we have a clone bay. Yeah, and this time the clone bay will actually work. Ha! No loss of crew. Slowly creeps upon a cluster of the creatures from behind without warning the giant arachnids turn and charge. However, your team stays in control before long you've beaten them back. Giving us 5 fuel, 5 missiles, 11 scrap. Hooray. We can hit this beacon up before the exit. Let's do it. I really need to get shields up as soon as possible. Discovery another unlicensed uncharted mantis colony. They certainly waste no time expanding their claims. A mantis ship moves to intercept you before you can jump away. Let's get the defense drone up so we don't eat missiles all day long. And other than that, they can't damage us. We don't need to waste another drone hacking or with the beam drone. Not that we have the power to do it. Let's just smash shields and keep going. Okay. Good. Good, good, good. Uh, go on oxygen next. Excellent. Back on shields. And one more volley should kill them. Oops, forgot to fire. <laughs> okay, just in time. Hitting that exit. Explore the Asher field again. Uh, okay, four missiles, 22 scrap. Beautiful. Next sector is going to be... Uh, I really want to hit as many red sectors as possible for scrap. So we're going to go to NG Homeworlds and then back around. We are also an NG ship. There might be some quests that we can accomplish here. Special events. So let's try and upgrade our ship. Let's try and get some scrap. You arrive in NG space. The Mantis have been threatening the NG core worlds, which you should be able to stock up for your journey. So kind of a shopping mall sector. I mean, as you can see right away, store right there. I don't think we're going to hit it up. We're okay for weapons. We really need to upgrade shields, engines, maybe get dual lasers up at the same time. Five shots is better than three. Uh, give them fuel. Yes, we have enough. And they will give us upgrade reactor. Perfect. That That's very important. That's worth a good 25, 20 scrap right there. Excellent. I'm going to try and hit this quest. Only loop around like that. <laughs> you know, the earlier uh, sectors, they're going to get eaten, so let me hit those first. And I should be upgrading pretty soon. Federation of Criticism is being broadcast. Send an away party, of course. New quest. If you're loyal to the Federation, you can still save them. Of course, I'm loyal to the Federation. I'm risking everything. Save you guys. Two missiles, one drone, 17 scrap. Let's upgrade shields and 
That'll give us a little bit more protection, and let's keep bouncing around here. Okay, Astra Field's so glad I did that. Um, they have no missiles, they have nothing. Let's attack shields. Let the uh, asteroids tear them apart. They're going to board. Uh, let's hack their teleporter and get them away from that. Save boarded with an NG. Uh, maybe next time I'll wait for the boarding party to see exactly who it is. Okay, their shields are completely down in. <laughs> okay, you know what, NG? You, you want to be over here so bad, take suffocation damage. Eat hot Lanius laser. We're lucky, we'll be glad to have your corpse on our ship. Oh, big hit to weapons. That's not good. Maybe I should have put the defense drone on. Protect me from these asteroids. Wasn't expecting such a huge impact from that. Usually they don't work so quickly. You know, you get like one or two at a time. Four fuel, two missiles, 15 scrap. No. Good, good, good. Pretty decent, but we're okay for right now, so... Alrighty then. See, 27 scrap, a little bit better, I think. Another store here. We'll probably hit it up, maybe get some healing with some supplies, but big purchases, maybe not. Oh, now we get the defense show mark one. That could have saved us 50 scrap. And uh it hasn't really saved us for much damage. But we can sell it for 25 scrap at the store. I think I definitely will. And maybe having two defense drones later on might be worth it. Merchant ships passing through the area. Basically, there's nothing going on here. This beacon. Next, next, next. Store. We can go for fuel. Maybe some drone parts. Ion bomb is pretty okay, but it takes forever to charge up. Cloaking is really good. Strap recovery arm is pretty good, too. We can sell... Teleporter for 35. That'll give us 108. And then another 25. Give us 130 something. Not enough to buy things. Not really desperate for scrap. What we will do is we will upgrade weapons. And get the power, so that way we can have dual lasers on as well. And we will fix up a bit. Uh, we want to hit both of those quest beacons. How much? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, like eight or nine. So one, two, three. Three, four. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, maybe. I'll even try and bomb rush quests. Local sensors pick up two ships engaged in heated battle. It seems the Mantis military ship will surely defeat its prey. Aid a civilian ship, stay out of it. We, of course, will aid. They have teleporter again and a cloning bay. Uh, they have nothing that can get through our shields. No, no missiles, nothing. Uh...
Let's first laser shields and dual laser to clone bay. Maybe. We're gonna teleport on with a mantis. I'll put this guy into the engine room. I mean, the doors room. Engine room guy going to the doors room and we can suffocate the mantis out, maybe. He's gonna attack our drone control, which. We're not using drones right now, so. Oh, we can actually just open up this door. I didn't even notice that door. Uh. And we can open up these doors. We want to do a laser shields. And I teleport him back. Let's close all the doors. Open all doors. Oops. There we go. And they'll be dead. Okay, so we saved the drone part by doing that. Hey, anti-ship fire drone. Nice. What's going on? Oh, right. Delanius is sucking all the oxygen out. Uh, that's okay. These things happen. What's well, a little slight asphyxiation between friends? Okay, let's take a look at that fire drone. Uh, three power. Three power. Lights fires everywhere, but for three power... Might be cell bait. Okay, back to stations. Set this quest. Five full points repaired. Nice. I think that's exactly how many we're missing. I don't think we have made it without your help. Let my friends patch up your hull. Okay, they have a store. Backup battery. Crew teleporter med bay. Explosive replicator, a couple of NGs. Flak is pretty good. Reverse laser 2, Flak. Fortunately, I'll take pretty much all of our scrap. Uh, we can sell. Nigel 25, we can try to teleport for 35, that gives us 60. Yeah, 60. So, one of the French for like 25, that's 85. We're going to need 65 and another bit of power to get going. So we're going to need 65 and 25 is 90. And we have 35, 25, 60, another 25. 85 plus 74. We can do it. Do we really want flak though? Five lasers and flak is not a bad loadout. But I think we're okay for now. I'm gonna sell the fire drone. Keep the defense drones for now. And we're going to upgrade our ship. Some more dodge chance in. And move on. Stress signal coming from a small space station orbit on a planet or satellite defense systems has gone haywire and the repair crew can't approach without being fired on or looking for help to fix or disable it. Of course we will promise to help, and because we have NGs we can remotely repair it. And we got two fuel, one drone part, and 40 scrap. Excellent. Big, big rewards. Hit up this quest before it gets eaten. 
ASB allies. You arrive in the sector, see a small Federation outpost using their anti-ship battery to fire at an automated drone. Debris from other ships is strewn around the area. Looks like the brunt of the battle is already over. You move in to assist. To have a beam drone. We can take down our shields, maybe. So let's get rid of weapons and drone. Good. Let's keep it going. Oh, we shot their drone out. We shot it in the face. Okay, let's go for shields next. Good. One more. Oh, weapons got a hole punched right through it. One more volley should do it. Yay. Three fuel, one drone part, 15 scrap, and they give us an NG. Pair our hull, give us two missiles, one drone part, 41 scrap. Kinda regretting not buying that flat cannon, but they are pretty common. Maybe we'll get another one soon. Space is no longer safe, let me join your crew. I'll have the station's drones patch up your ship. Welcome aboard, Monsieur NG. You are our new shield person. Mons Monsvik. Good. Save your position and carry on. We can hit this guy before the exit. Let's do it. Pay their toll, yeah, right? Welcome to our peaking for a small fee. We'll let you continue on your way. Screw you, prior rigor. Uh, no, I think you'll regret this decision. Let's get the defense drone up because they have a missile weapon. I mean, we have 32% dodge chance right now, but why take chances when we've also been saving... Uh, we've been saving drone parts lately. Let's throw everything at shields. Nice. Uh, next we'll hit piloting so they can't dodge anymore. Good thing we got that second level of shields up. We're trying to escape. Good luck with a bad piloting system. Boom boom. And get the burst laser somewhere. They want to surrender one fuel, two missiles, 17 scrap. No. And we get one miss, one fuel, one missile, 22 scrap. Okay, comparable. And we jump to the exit. We move on to the next sector. Number of privately owned ship construction platforms in the area. You find out one has a slot open for some immediate work. Inquire about their specialty piloting subsystem for nine. That is a steal. I will do it. It's good to have your piloting up. If it gets hit, you don't lose all of your dodge chance. I think it costs like 25 or something like that for the first level. So that getting that for nine is phenomenal. Next sector. Zoltan controlled, rock controlled. I said earlier we would like to hit as many red zones as possible. Rock controlled it is. Rock people are powerful and proud. Race is not unheard of to have a peaceful journey through their lands, but don't count on it. Eww. Asteroid field, okay. Minute, minute fissures in their shields spark and crackle as the ship jumps in the wake of a huge asteroid. More asteroids follow, as does a lost and aggressive rock pirate ship. They have a teleporter. They have a bunch of lasers. I want to put the defense drone on. I do not want to get rocked by asteroids again. Ha! Get it? They have a burst laser mark two, so that's three. Each they have a couple more lasers than we do. Uh. They're gonna board us, they're rock. Let's try and hit weapons. Everything. Yep, yeah, that's a rock guy. Let's teleport him off. I don't feel like dealing with rock guys right now. Go back for once you came, foul demon! Alright, let's everything on weapons. Good, we got the big scary laser off. Let's hit shields next, try and rip them apart. Okay. Well, 
once more onto the shields. Good. Uh, one more asteroid should do it, but why wait? And they're done. Giving us two missiles, one drone, 41 scrap. Let us jump. Uh, let's just check out the distress beacon. As soon as your ride stress signal shots are fired towards your ship, it's a trap! Uh, if both of these only fire one, we're alright. So, no need to hack or anything. Wait for the full might of our arsenal. Okay. That fires one, that fires two, but as long as we're not firing at the same exact time, we will take no damage. Shields down. Go for weapons next. Because there's a fire in their shields. Well, I guess. Let's take a picture. A couple of humans. We might be able to kill them while they're repairing. That guy's dead. Uh, we will not be able to kill them. We only have two hull points left, and yeah, so maybe we could get lucky. Two fuel, no, will not accept surrender, and you're dead. One missile, one drone, 41. Excellent. That's what you get for trying to trap people. Find select cruiser or rockship at standoff. Both with weapons aren't ready to fight. You could intervene before things get out of hand. Hell, and see what's wrong. Select captain explains that they upgraded a rockship reactor and now the thick boulder heads are refusing to pay for the work done. The rock captain says the slime balls did a poor job. That is not worth their agreed upon price. We can pay it for them. We can demand that they have to pay it or we just leave. I think what we're going to do is we're going to demand that they pay it. We'll either get combat. Maybe they'll actually agree to pay it. Uh, if they agree to pay it, the slugs might give us more reactor power. Either way, better stuff. Maybe. But we are apparently a slime bowl defender, and they want to fight. And they have a flat cannon, which will strip our shields. They have an ion. Uh, hmm. Don't think we need drones for this. Yeah, as long as they... Yeah, let's hit everything on weapons. Took nothing down, wonderful. Okay, a couple of hull points, not big deal. Okay, big scaries are down, let's go on shields next. Actually, let's... Do this the right way. Time our shots. Okay. Come on, just die already. Two fuel, one drone, sixteen. Contact the slugs. Yes. Slugs upgrade the reactor. So that's like another 30 scrap. Potentially. Yeah, like 25, 30 scrap. We have 211 right now. Any stores? Yes, there is a store. Let's go there. We have money to burn. You come across a rock trading post that's ready to deal with outsiders, but they need to sell the last of their stock and will pay their dues for the transaction when they return home. They have repair arm, hull repair, combat one, defense scramble, which we already have, crew, mind control, backup, go to weapons. I think we buy the hull repair drone. Give us healing when we need it later on in the game. We have, we have the money. Why not? 
Okay, any other stores in the vicinity? No. So we'll probably end up upgrading shortly. A few freighters pass by, a few zone communications, must not want to lay their reputation talking to foreigners. Should have brought fuel back at that store, that was stupid. Uh, great. Solar flares. The usual solar activity in this region means you need to get out quick. The rock pirate nearby apparently thinks otherwise as they move to attack your ship. They have a bunch of lasers. Let us hack their weapons. Let's get the beam drone on. Let's vent as much of the ship as possible in case there are fires. They'll go out pretty quickly. Actually, we want that. There we go. Okay. Good. I'm going to try and get them to fire out of sync with each other. And we're going to go on weapons. Good. Still have a couple of big scaries. Why is that energy about to die? Good job. Good job, me. Good job. Uh, go on shields next. Okay. Ship explodes, one fuel, one drone, 31 scrap. Let's close our doors and get out of dodge. You encounter a small craft with minimal propulsion. Its rock crew explains that the rock home world is run on lies and propaganda to keep the populace in check and that they want no part of it. If we pick choice number one, they're going to attack us. Um... They have missiles, a couple of lasers, three laser shots, they have three shields. Pretty scary stuff. Ugh. Shields really, it's just gonna take make things take forever. Defense drone will stop that. We're okay if they attack, but uh promise to share with them the truth they've been denied and the guy might join us. Nope, can't risk being lied to again. So Alright. Don't, uh, don't lose out on anything, don't... Well, maybe we should have gone for combat. 157 scrap, okay. Another asteroid, burst laser 2. Let's put the defense drone on. I do not feel like getting eaten by asteroids again. And they have a missile, so... Definitely worth it. Let's go on... Shields. Good. Weapons. For fuel, for. Yeah, we need fuel, so I will accept that. It's a naturally warlike species with few intergalactic diplomatic ties. The rock people have garnered quite a reputation as fearsome pirates. You stumble across one of their ships and they promptly live up to type. They have a beam, a stunner, and a missile. We're going to get the defense drone on. And they can't do any damage to us. So we will wait for everything, all our weapons to charge. We'll hit shields. Okay, a lot of missing. There we go. Hit piloting next, so there's no missing in the future. And back on shields.
And one more should do it. Giving us one fuel, one missile, 32 scrap. We are doing all right. Definitely want to get the next layer of shields up. Maybe drones will have be able to have beam and defense at the same time. But we're okay. Rock ship flies past your window and you recognize outcast decorations on the hull. These must be pirates, huh? Yeah, don't say. Okay, that is a burst laser Mark III. That is super scary. They can fire five shots with that. Um. No missiles, and I have the beams. They get through our shields. Big, big promise. I also have a teleporter. This can be very, very dangerous. Uh, I can't deal. The rock man has way too much health. I will teleport him back. Hope that 40% dodge chance is enough to dodge some of these incomings. Oh, not enough to get it completely taken offline. But everything missed except for one. Uh, we can send the engine in to repair. Teleport this guy back. Shields next. Get that back. Get everybody on. And maybe we should stop using the beam drone. One missile, one drone, 28 scrap. Uh, how many jumps before the exit? One, two, maybe three. Yeah, let's risk it. Rock Captain hails you. It is improper of me to contact off-worlders, but this is an important emergency. We are on our way to deliver our passenger to her new husband, the Grand Basilisk of Numa 5. When our engines broke down, will you take possession of her and make haste to Numa 5? Sure. You surprise me, off-worlder. Thank you. The passenger will be with you momentarily. She refuses to enter the main hold and prefers to wait in the cargo bay. Added a quest marker to the next sector. All right. Um, let's not risk it. Let's just get out. Do not want to be caught unawares by rebels. We arrive at the long range beacon with the other drive charge. You can jump to the next sector. Refuel for three drone parts. No, because we are low on fuel ourselves. Next. Yeah, we wouldn't have made it. We wouldn't have made it. Mantis Homeworlds. Okay. If you enter the poorly charted area of space, it's known to be home to the Mantis. Ensure your hull plating is up to scratch and you have enough fuel in the tank to make it through. Uh, hull is up to scratch. Fuel is a different story. There's a store right away. I will check that out. They have plenty of scrap. Uh, getting some weapons might be good. Certain about what you'll discover this beacon, you scan the surroundings, you detect several warnings on wideband channels discouraging any violence and protected trade space. Perhaps you can find some wares nearby. We have our Flak 1. We have Charge Ion, Reverse Ion Field is pretty good, Pegasus Missile, Defense Drone 2, believe it or not, not as good as a Defense Drone 1. Gets distracted easily. I think we're going to go, let's see, 65 and we need 60, so that's 125 and we're going to need another 85. Well, it's better than uh, dual lasers for 10, I think. So, if we can get both of them up, definitely help. Uh, charge Ion is also really good. First Iron Field is, is, is pretty alright as well. But we're going to need to get through shields pretty soon, so let's buy the flak, buy some fuel, let's not be stupid. Let's upgrade weapons.
Let's upgrade again. And get... There you have it. So now we can have... Eight shots being fired. At any given time. Um, having third layer shields pretty important. But, uh... We'll move on for now. You over here, Mantis. Come chatter, greed. Next ship is your turn. Good hunting. They don't see you yet. Let's attack. They have a teleporter. Of course they do. Burst laser mark three. Of course they do. And a small bomb. We want to get weapons down as soon as possible. Uh, we will hack the teleporter. Do not want to deal with Mantis on my ship. Especially two of them. Go away. Let everything charge up. Flak on weapons. Dual lasers, burst lasers on weapons. And we got the big scary down. They're gonna take down our oxygen. Really gotta get the next layer of doors up. This is getting silly. Okay, let's let's just kill them. Get off my ship. There you go, fix that. You get off doors, get back to where you're belonging. Phew. Okay. Alright, let's see what what's doing in their ship. A couple of mantises. Let's just die. Die, die, die. Two missiles, one drone, 38. Good, good, good. Definitely need to get shields up. Couple more in engines. Maybe drone. Get a couple more upgrades in drone, but for right now, we should be okay. That's a dead end, of course. Alright, uh, go here, I guess. Then distress, then quest. So I meant this ship hunting in the distance. Aid this civilian ship, yes, please. They have missiles, gotta get the defense drone on. They also have a teleporter. Hack that. We are running dangerously low. Our drone parts have a burst laser mark two. We should be fine. Get back. Wait for everything to get charged up. And we will go on. Shields and weapons. Good. Brick Scary is offline. Ah. Okay. Boom. And the ship breaks apart, one fuel, one drone, 50 scrap, time to contact. And we get, hey, double reward, yay. Oh, but unfortunately they did not survive. But we take what we can. 22 scrap. Hit the stress beacon, hit the quest. You find a number, okay, giants, alien spiders again, we have a clone bay. 
Gay, we win. Contact the station owners. 24 scrap 4 missiles, 2 drones. Some kind of a bomb weapon would be really good. Hit up the quest. Vast tunnel network near the surface of NEMA 5 indicates an advanced rock civilization. This must be where you were asked to deliver the passenger. Realizing arrival is imminent, the passenger silent so far, pleased with you not to hand her over. She's interrupted by the Grand Basilisk Chief Aide. The alien vessel holding the Basilisk's wife delivered to us. You'll be rewarded well. If we hand her over, we get, you know, middling scrap rewards, I believe. If we refuse to comply, we get into some combat, but she joins us. And we can always use a big, beefy rock lady in our door system. So let's uh, let's refuse to comply. We get Ariadne, who's a good fighter, a good engine person. I have to see if she's better than uh, Brecken at engines. Probably not. They have a Flak 2, which is horrifically bad. And a laser. Heavy laser. I was led to believe your kind did not know mercy. I would join you, but quickly you must jump away. They will not tolerate. She's inter interrupted by weapons fire from the Basilis escort get you out of there. Let's put her on sensors for now. They don't have any... Yeah, okay. Um, let's... The flak takes like a good 20 seconds to charge if we can hack their weapons. We can maybe take it down before it can fire. Yes, we got most of our weapons down. What do they have left? A two-shot heavy laser it bounces harmlessly off our shields. Yay. Let's do that again. Okay, everything's down. Except for their piddling little laser. Good, 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 good. Let's do that again. Okay, fires don't matter, rock crew are immune to fire, but their weapons are completely down. Let's go for shields next. Time is a little off there, definitely. And they're done. As escort eliminated, the Grand Bastos dispatches an entire fleet. There's just time to take your pick from the wreck before you jump out of their reach. One fuel, one drone, 47 scrap. She is green in engines. Brecken is yellow in engines. So she will remain our sensor slash door person for right now. Uh, we will wait for a store. But I definitely want to get X layer of shields up. You arrive just in time to see an usually well-armed energy ship destroying a small pirate craft. The teleporter signal is detected. Intruder on deck. A young mantis' charred uniform has teleported onto the deck. He begs for sanctuary from the NG and offers to serve in exchange for your protection. The NG have already traced the teleporter signal and are offering a deal in exchange for the prisoner. Uh, we have plenty of scrap. I don't want a bounty. A mantis crew member would be good. I will side with a fugitive to fight the NG ship. Yay! And we get Roper, who's really good at fighting. And we will put him on doors, quickly. And they have pipe beam, couple of lasers, and ion. If they get their act together and fire everything at the same damn time, we might take damage. But uh, we should be okay otherwise. Actually, let's start with flak. And then the lasers. Good. Big scaries are offline. Just have a pea shooter left. Let's do that again. And we'll go on clone bay as well as weapons this time. Good, clone bay is down. They'll probably get it up before we can kill them, but uh, definitely not gonna stop me from trying. All right, definitely mistiming all of this, but. Uh, They're gonna die pretty soon. Like right now. Yay. Bye, NG. Sorry, I'm an NG, but hey, Mantis, remember better. And we also get definitely more than we would have gotten bounty wise. And if we would have taken the bounty option, the Mantis might have damaged our hull, killed a crew member, something. 
But it really is a, a coin flip, that event. I mean, even if you... Sometimes there's Mantis on board that ship, and they still do hull damage. It's, you know, it's all a trap. There's a lot of weirdness with that one. Uh, two missiles, one drone, 45 scrap. It's possible it could determine, you know, based on what sector we're in. I mean, we're in Mantis homeworld, so it's better to side with Mantis than NG. That might have something to do with it. Let's check out this distress beacon and think more of it. No more of it. Stress signals coming from a small space station. Okay, here's the defense system again. Promise to help. Engine crew, fix it. And we get 54 scrap, two missiles, one drone. I really wish I could do something with these missiles. Uh, let's jump out here. We really need fuel badly. A uh, three shielded burst laser mark two burst laser mark twos. Oh boy. And they're going to hack us. Let's get the defense drone up. And they still hack us. Great. Freaking fantastic. Let's, let's, uh... Let's hack their hacking. Oh, boy. Okay. Got their weapons down. That's good. They got one back up. We're gonna have to hit their weapons again. Hack their hacking. Maybe they'll. That was horrible. This is why you get play at level 3 shields up ASAP. Can't run, I have no fuel. I have the hull repair drone, which I will use to heal up after this. Assuming I survive. Okay, good, got the weapons down again. Of course. Wow. <sighs> Wonderful. Holy crap. One missile, one drone part, 26 scrap. I think I will not accept. Which will probably end up being my death. Okay. <sighs> Barely survived that. Do we get any fuel? Yes, we got one fuel. Ugh, what a mess. What a mess. Let's uh let's get the hull repair guy out here. <sighs> well once we're healed anyways. <sighs> but yeah, that that definitely could go better, and that is why I'm going to put uh a lot into shields right now. And a little bit into engines as well. We really need uh, cloaking um, cloaking would be good. Really we can only take one more system so we have to be very choosy. Uh, 
Okay, we'll use one more of these. And then we'll get out of here. There is a store. Um, how many drums do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. No, well, we can buy the store, but we need we need fuel. Cross pass mentorship. That looks to have had dozens of layers of armor plating added over. It must have been a hundred year career. It's Captain Legendary Thief Kazakaka Plaka Plaka. Your crew look frightened. Attempt to hail him. Your men screamer steps forward. They perform a weird kind of alien haka. You meanwhile charge the battle systems. Okay. Uh, no need for anything other than just lasers and things. I have a couple of shots. I'm gonna choose to save drone parts here. Uh, this is a special event as part of the Mantis Ship Unlock quest. If you have a teleporter and level 2 or 3 med bay, you'll be able to uh, get the Mantis Ship Unlocked. You'll also be able to get Kazakh blah, blah 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 as a crew member. He's like max everything. That's great. I don't know how this quest works as far as if you have a clone bay instead of a med bay. Uh, I don't have a teleporter anyways, it's a moot point. Uh, getting a teleporter will, would be okay. I mean, we have the rock, remember? We have the mantis. I think we definitely uh, can get a teleporter as our final system. Might definitely be beneficial. I mean, the other choices are mind control. Um... Uh, Cloaking. But, uh, I think Crew Teleporter might help. Hey, two fuel, great. Crate Mystery Unresolved. Yeah, well, I just spoiled it, sorry. Uh, but there it is. Fights to the last, you pick the scraps. Mystery Unresolved. Um, let's go to the store, get some fuel. You have scrap, quickly come dock before the warriors see you. Medbay crew teleporter. We have another mantis who's really good at fighting. Um, hmm. Mind control's pretty good, but we only have room for one more system. So I think we are going to go with crew teleporter. We're gonna buy. Uh, maybe we won't buy power. We'll see. And I think our. Uh, yeah, she's good at fighting. Roper's good at fighting. They, they will be our boarding crew. It sucks that's all the way up here. Why is that guy not on? Ugh, I'm horrible. Should have returned them to their place of business hours ago. Apologize for that. You're probably all screaming at your devices. Get the fuel, very important, and let us jump. Hopefully we make it to the exit. There was anything, just strip the ship for any useful scrap. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Uh, data storage, just because an updated map, there's like one beacon left. So we're just, we're just gonna do that. Get the free scrap, move on. And it looks like we're just gonna make it to the exit once again. You fancy you see something's moving in Shadows of the Beacon, but all remains still, and now finally the exit. You have arrived at the Long Range Beacon. When the FDL drive is charged, you can jump to the next sector. Small space station, move in. You dock with the station, take a look inside. However, no sooner do you open the airlock than pirates burst in. Meanwhile, scanners pick up previously undetected pirate ship moving into attack. Uh, we will put the defense drone on. They have missiles, they have a couple of mantis running around. Mantis and a human, so you'll mantis and rock. Hopefully, uh... We have a couple, wow, really big scary ship right here. Let's hack weapons. And let's... Fire everything at weapons. Mm 
Our crew should just survive the attack. Yes, they do. Put them back to stations. Oh, I never... Don't get ropers on doors. Rock Lady Ariad is on sensors. They have a fire in their weapon bay. Beautiful. Let's go on shields then. And there's fire and shields as well. Okay, we're gonna go on the med bay next. Two fuel, one drone. Eh, I really need fuel, but not that much. Okay, med bay's down. We are not gonna attack anymore. Let the fires deal with it. Yeah, if they didn't have intruders, we would have intruded them. We could have really mopped up here. Uh, looks like the fire is not going to kill them. So let's just kill them ourselves. Oh, I have reconstructed the teleport. That, that was silly. I could have, yeah, I could have killed them with my beastly uh, boarding crew. Should have exploded, leaving behind a substantial collection of useful scrap. Three fuel. Yay! Better than taking that. Uh, Surrender offer one missile, 40 scrap. And we move on to Sector 6. Pirate controlled or Mantis controlled? Just dealt with a lot of Mantis. That nebula scares the crap out of me, probably. So, But we can do Pirate and this guy, then this guy. So Pirate uh, has some slavers, some stores. Might be able to get another crew member. Doing okay. So an isolated region was thrown to chaos at the start of rebellion. Even in peacetime, it was always beset by pirates, but now it houses a center of operations for countless pirate fleets. Okay, there's a store right away. Let's try and jump around before we reach here. Try to maximize our scrap. And especially well-armed well pirate ship approaches you. Hand over one of your crew members and the rest of you can go free unharmed. Draw straws. Send a crew member over to slavers. We will never surrender to slavers. They have mind control. Let's hack their mind control. That will allow us to mind control one of their crew instead. Uh, teleporting. They have a lot of crew to have a clone bay. Probably not worth it. They have big scaries. Okay, take the big scaries down. We can hit to the shields, but we're okay. Okay, hack. their weapons down. They want to surrender with a rock person. Take one of our slaves as tribute. If you destroy us, they will die anyways. How are they doing on health? Can I potentially kill the crew? Uh yeah, let's let's accept rock dude. He's good at repairing and engines. We'll leave him in, this, in there for now. Probably should have just killed him. Always good to have extra crew. Beacon has been placed too close to Supergiant Class M Star. The ship will gradually overheat until you get out of here or die. A pirate apparently oblivious to the danger of the sun moves in to engage. They have beams and a heavy laser. I want to uh, the bomb. They're going to hack the defense drone up. Uh, 
Uh, yeah. Really don't want them hacking. Green drone would be good to have right here. Um, the hack doors. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, they can't do anything to us unless that bomb, like, destroys something important. It's an ion bomb, so still can't do damage to us. Uh, let's get shields down. There's a fire, excellent. And ship appears to be powering up its FDL. It's trying to escape. You can't, your entire ship's on fire. Okay, to add our engines, that's fine. Oh, they have a clone bay. Let's uh let's get rid of that clone bay. Four missiles, one drone part twenty-four, no, no not accept surrender. The fire will probably just blow up the ship before it blows up the crew. Okay, we got some scrap. Let the rock handle that. Way back to stations. Jump around the nebula a little bit. And then we'll head to the store. Ion storm, of course. You jump in the middle of a plasma storm. Multiple recently incapacitated ships loom in the shadows. Refuel illuminated by the lightning. Manually search for extra service equipment. Have your pilot ex carefully explore the debris. Yes, let's do that. Most of the debris is hardly even usable scrap, however, you eventually find an intact weapon that can be mounted on your ship. We get a chain burst laser. Not really that great. I mean, for one less power gain, pretty much the same thing. Uh, your ship emerges quite far away from the beacon. You see a rebel ship waiting nearby, undoubtedly stationed to look for you. Attack the ship, attempt to remain concealed. Let's attack them. Let's turn everything on that needs on. Um. Nothing worth hacking, nothing worth defense droning about. Uh, shields all the way up, please. Uh, no maybe, no nothing. Let's try killing everybody. Boarding drone. In the clone bay. Okay. Let's target that then. Good, good, good. Uh, put you in piloting for now. You can go in here. Deal with that. Boarding drone. Fix up the breach in the clone bay. Um, let's target the drone again. Okay, lots of fires. Let's get our people back. They can't hurt us, let's just let the fire ravage their ship. Probably like one crew member left alive. It's yours. Show us your honor by allowing us to leave with our lives. Stun bomb, 67 scraps, 6 fuel. Pretty good offer. And I will accept. I need the fuel. 
Two stun scraps, amazing. Stun bombs, good selling. Looks like they're offer. Uh, they're having the Lanius. I can teleport the Lanius over. Stun the room. And suck the air out. Duh. I think we're gonna go like this. A few small ships are visible on the vid screen, and you almost activate weapons targeting. However, sensors indicate that you are simply honest merchants. The pirates must be making you jumpy. Message them, ask them about their wares. We have. Well, Mantises, backup battery, med bay, another flak one, combat boarding, system repair, swarm. Combat one might be good to have. System repair might be good to have. Black one, not really. We're changing dual laser into something. Buying this will let us do something with all these million missiles we have. Yeah, I think uh, I think that's what we'll do. We will sell the stun bomb, sell the chain laser, sell dual lasers, and buy the swarm missile. And we will upgrade weapons one, power one, so we can have it all on. And yeah, move on from there. Uh, let's go down. Slavers again. We will never surrender our crew to slavers. They have missiles. French drone up. Let's see what they have in their ship. Two humans only. Yeah, we are definitely going to board them, like, as soon as this uh, Zoltan shield is down. They can't do anything to us. So we will definitely 100% board them. Okay, it appears the slaves did not survive the fighting. You find their burnt bodies in the hold, but before you strip the ship, you hear faint noises in the walls. You break off a latch, and a slave falls out of a hidden compartment, coughing. Once recomposed, the slave offers to join your crew. Three fuel, one drone, 63 scrap, and a Zoltan. Uh, he's good at piloting, which is a bit of a waste of his abilities. He has a racial ability that any room that requires power, if you put him in that room, he will pay for one power. So why don't I stick them in drones for now? Save everything. I think uh, we're gonna go for drone control next. Get that updated a little bit, but uh, we're doing all right. Doing all right so far. The only thing within scanning range is an old abandoned mining structure in a resupply station. They appear to have been picked clean by marauders. Nothing doing. Pirate ship was lying in wait inside this asteroid. Inside the asteroid field, it immediately moves into attack. I will not defense drone this time. And I will put him back on doors. And I'll get everybody fighting this guy. Uh, weapons wise, they're not too bad. Let's get the clone bay down. Good. Uh, 
Uh, actually, can we just, yeah. Uh, that's a fire bomb. We want that down as soon as possible. It's swarm missile. Swarm missiles give us three missiles for the price of one. Okay, good. All the weapons are down. Uh, let's see who is in. Who's left alive in their ship? A mantis and a rock. Oh, no, that's bad. <laughs> Close the door first. Teleport. Should be able to kill their crew. We have more health, more skill. Oh, but their stupid thingy is still on. Good. <laughs> Got off just in time. They would have came back to life and... I don't know. Yeah. Uh, two missiles, one drone, 45 scrap. Excellent. Let's get our people back. And get out of here. Once you arrive, your screen lights up with warnings. A nearby pirate seems to have advanced hacking tools. And they have tried to shut down your engines. Your crew managed to keep them barely operational and you move into attack. Continue or hacking system stun. I will get rid of no more hacking. Bye hacking. The hacking system automatically counters the digital assault and you move in to fight the ship. Looks like they're going to try and board. They have missiles, defense drone. Oh, gotta reorder. Right, okay. So they're gonna board me with a mantis. Uh, let's just fire things. Okay, they went back. So I think we should teleport our own people. Okay. Our uh, outdoor man can uh, Okay, let's teleport our people back. Actually, let's bring engine human in to support rock sensor person. Okay, now they teleported back, so now our people on the board their ship take care of this guy. Everybody back. No, kill, kill the person. Yay. Four fuel, 42 scrap. Excellent, excellent, excellent. back and get ready to jump okay so I'm gonna get one two three four five six or seven one two one one two three four yeah let's do that You catch a glimpse of strange signal coming from a space station before your sensors shut off unexpectedly. As you discover that your sensors are being jammed, you hear hostiles beam onto your ship. Ha countered remote hacking. Hacking system automatically counters digital assault. Sensors flicker back on. You prepare to fight the borders. Uh, you get into the doors. Our clone bay back on, so we get Pomeroy back.
How can I fit three? Okay. Guaranteed. Yep, we just lost Roper. And we're gonna lose the rock person as well pretty soon. Oh, this is horrible. That really sucks, we lost Roper. Um, this guy's about to die. Ah, uh, wonderful. I'm doing so well at this. Okay, uh, definitely upgrade. Freaking cloning bay. Absolutely horrible losing that guy. But two rocks, they'll make a pretty decent boarding party. Close all the doors. Why don't we upgrade our doors and sensors? Rocks to boarding and move on and mourn our lost crew member. Pulsar, great. <laughs> Here go all our shields. Uh, I'm gonna hack their teleport. I had enough borders for a little while. And I am going to teleport onto the teleporter system while trying to disable their med bay. Failing miserably at it. Shields are down, let's try and get rid of our weapons. Two missiles, one drone, 20 in scrap. Uh, no. Bye. Maybe I should have taken it, I don't know. But, uh, let's fix up our doors and move on. Positions. Mm -hmm. 
You arrive in Asteroid Belt to discover that a Rebel Automated Scout has been stationed here. Prepare for a fight. Bench drone on. Shields are still down. Hacking still got through. That's amazing. Oh, this is bad. <laughs> Why don't we hack their hacking and maybe we can get our weapons free? Guys, fix up the hacking, I guess. Uh, okay, good. Now they can't dodge. Swarm on. Weapons, good. All the weapons. Dangerous weapons are down. Okay, we're coming back. We're coming back. Missiles away! One fuel, one drone, 49 scrap, and this music is really loud! Let's get out of here. Sell 15 missiles, 45 scrap. Uh, yeah, we can afford to do that. Oh, just made it before the Rebels. You ride the long-range beacon, FDL drives charge, you can join the next sector. Number of privately owned ship construction platforms, inquire about their specialty. Reactor for 20, that's a good deal. Because it'll cost us like 35 at this point, 30, 35 at this point. Um, let's get hull repair going. Boy, we're really running low on drone parts. Okay. Next sector, uncharted or pirate. We'll go pirate again. Need some fuel, some drone parts. A few years ago, this region was bustling with trade activity. Now it is overrun with bandits and marauders. You should tread lightly here. Defense drone back. There's a store. Let's buy some fuel, some drone parts. Well armed transport ship and a squadron of fighters are in orbit nearby. You are wary of their trustworthiness, but beggars can't be choosers. FDL recharge, anti beam chain ion. Chain ion is really good against shields. Another defense drone, anti personal. Border, NG. Um, okay, if we make it to the end of the sector, which we maybe will, maybe won't, uh, we get 10 points of hull repair. We get a bunch of fuel. Um, exit's over here. We can bum rush the exit. Um, I just buy all the fuel just to be on the safe side. Uh, drone parts we might also get elsewhere, but let's do that. Um, engines we can get up, or we can get shields up. Let's hold on for a little while. Um, hacking, I might want to get up as well. But uh, I think uh, that'll do it for today. We'll have the thrilling conclusion next time. 
hit the like button if you enjoyed, and please subscribe. We'll be posting FDL videos on the regular from here on out. Thank you very much for watching. Once again, I'm Demonic Dr. Phil, and this has been FTL Advanced Edition.